right, y'all. We're back in it again. I'm about to try another masterpiece, another concoction from my boy Jay Heezy, otherwise known as John. Today, he made agua de horchata. Forgive him on his pronunciation, he's just learning, but you know, that's what he was trying to say. I'm just impressed that I even tried to do this in the first place. I'm not sure a lot of white people even know what this is, but all my Mexican people know what it is. Agua de horchata, staple in any taqueria or any Mexican restaurant. You gotta have some good horchata. A lot of people, you know, cheat and do just the little packets or whatever. My man's actually did the old fashioned way, grounded up the, the rice and did the whole thing. So I'm expecting big things. Let's get into it. I'm, I'm really thirsty right now. So hopefully that'll help this taste a lot better, but I have faith that it'll be good. Let's, let's give it a taste here. I will say first that I, I really appreciate him trying to <laughs> decorate with this <laughs> stick of cinnamon. I don't know if he saw that on Google or something, but I've never seen I would have chopped that like this, but you know, whatever. I appreciate the effort, you know, it was pretty cool. And as far as the taste, you know what? It was a good try. I think what happened was there might've been just too much water. It does have that really good horchata flavor, like hidden. So when it's like, I drink it, and it tastes like water at first, but then like I get that nice horchata aftertaste. So I think I think he's just gonna have to give it another try and put a little bit less water. When you guys do it at home, don't follow exactly how much water he put in there. Put a little bit less water and this thing will be flames. I'm talking about flames, okay? So you know what? I want the horchata is really hard, like it's not hard to make, but you know, it's like it's really out of the box thing for for my boy to make. I'm not gonna be so hard on him at this time. Um, the flavor wasn't perfect. The flavor wasn't perfect, but it was pretty good. It was a nice effort. I really like it. Let me drink this again. Let me just make sure I know what I'm say talking about. Yeah. It has that it has that horchata flavor hidden, but it just just a little bit too much water, or else it would have been really really good. You know, to be honest with you, when I heard he was gonna be making some agua de horchata, I was like, man, do white people even like know what that is? Can they even do it? But then I thought to myself, you know what? That's just being a little bit too judgmental. And it is 2017, so I gotta be open-minded. And even though sometimes in, a, you know, in the political climate and all that, it seems like we're not making that much progress, this is proof. This is proof right here that we're making progress in the world, all right? White people are out here making bomb horchata, but yeah, so I'm gonna have to give it three yeah, Trevor yeah, faces yeah. out of five. The flavor just wasn't on point, and he did mess up with the canela stick a little bit, but uh, you know, I really appreciate the effort on this one. Go home, try it out, and I promise you it'll be really good. So uh, until next time, be easy, y'all.